is official. Wilson is dead. Well, Dan, that had to be the bloodiest and hands down the most brutal fight this city has ever seen. Coolidge was out of there faster than I've ever seen a victorious boxer leave the ring. Do you think he knew Wilson was dead? My guess would be yes, Richard. I could see from my position there the frenzy in his eyes. Give way to the realization of what he was doing. I think any man would have let the ring that fast. Dan, do you feel that this tragedy is going to have an effect on the world oh, of boxing? Oh, Richard, a tragedy like this can't help but shake the world of boxing to its very foundations. But paramount importance is during the sad weeks ahead, the eyes of the WBA remain... You said he was dead. Sorry about that, Floyd. What does it feel like? It's what it feel like. Killing a man. Beating another man to date with your bare hands. Are you a weirdo? No. He's a subject I have not interested. You are the first person I've ever met to have killed somebody. So? What does it feel like to kill a man? I'll tell you what. Give me one of the cigarettes you got up there and I'll tell you all about it. the little low boss. Is that Mexican? Your name is Spanish, but I'm Colombian. <laughs> Some hell you got there, honey. Thank you. And what is your name? Butch. Butch. What does it mean? I'm an American, honey. Our names don't mean shit. So, moving right along, Esmeralda. What is it you want to know? I want to know what it feels like to kill a man. I couldn't tell you. I didn't know he was dead until you told me he was dead. Now that I know he's dead, you wanna know how I feel about it? I don't feel the least bit bad about it. <laughs> 